check out part one of my Christmas celebrations if you haven't already. This is a super cute photo of my hubby and daughter. And this is another one of them at the mall, just enjoying life. So my daughter Zoe says this is her version of the Grinch. She had a Santa hat left over from her bluey Christmas uh, kit that she's been opening up. And she took some green Play-Doh and put the hat on it. And that's the Grinch, right? <laughs> You're so creative, boo boo Y'all, these dress shoes. Get that out your bed. <laughs> You guys, look at this pretty train. This train ride was so much fun. Hold on. <laughs> and we have a little one. Zoe! Zoe, did you have fun on the train ride? Look at that beautiful tree and those large ornaments. You guys, it is so cute. It's like a winter wonderland. This is my holiday meal at my company luncheon. Dessert, root beer, and all kinds of little holiday treats, like a popcorn ball. Shower steam. Yogurt cover pretzels. Christmas gummies, coconut, some more Christmas gummies, classic Chico sticks, and lastly some maple fudge. There was a super cute uh, person dressed up in a gingerbread costume at my job. It was so cute and funny. Um, they had the whole room laughing during the ugly sweater contest. <laughs> Holiday toes are done. My feet look so weird trying to put them on video. I just want to show you guys this beautiful glittery gel that I got um, on my toenails for the holidays. I absolutely am in love with it. And as you guys know, the gel polish doesn't easily come off. This doesn't look appealing, but I swear my feet don't look that horrible in real life, but they look terrible on video. Ha <laughs> ha. Alrighty, so y'all know I love to come on and just share everything that's inspiring me for the holidays just as I did for my Thanksgiving video because I think it gives people ideas and inspiration and it just feels good to celebrate the holidays. So I'm going to go ahead and share with you guys 
all of my daughter's holiday fashion accessories and things and all of my holiday fashion and accessories and things that I have in the house. A few of these items I did have last year, but I pulled them back out because they're appropriate for the holiday season. So I hope you guys enjoy. I'll go ahead and get into it. So for my daughter, I did get this from the secondhand store, Kid to Kid, but it's this beautiful mini like holiday inspired like gown and it's by the brand um the disney store and look at these cute little ruffle um sleeve bottoms and then the bottom of the gown is also ruffle it's absolutely adorable my daughter's i washed it of course after i got it from the store my daughter's already worn it a couple of times but i'll probably put it on her on christmas night it's absolutely gorgeous and um if you could go online and find this at a disney store your uh, daughter would love it also, I have this dress here. It's by the brand Zara. And it's this beautiful blue velvet because I wanted to give my daughter a switch up from just red and green for the holidays. So I'm not exactly sure when she'll wear this. I think she'll wear this to a funeral we have to go to. But um, yeah, it's a super cute blue velvet um, dress and it's Zara brand. And I think it's totally um, holiday, you know, ish. This my daughter is about to outgrow. She had it last year, but she's worn it a couple of times this year. Also, something else I got from the secondhand store. I don't think this is a brand per se. I think they just use this shirt. This is authentic um, JK khaki, JK girls. But anywho, someone did this beautiful reindeer with ornament um, and a bow little arrangement on this top. And I thought it was absolutely beautiful. Like I said, my daughter got the pleasure of wearing it last year and she's already worn it a couple of times this year. And also I picked this top up from the children's place. Um, and it's just really cute with the little ice um, skates and the sweater and tree and gift and mittens and, hat and Santa hat and some, I guess, hot chocolate and little earmuffs tree and candy canes and stars and snowflakes. So that is super cute. Um, I'm just showing these so you guys can see the total outfit, but my daughter's gonna wear these shoes uh, with the black tights with this dress. And then um, this was part of the what I got my toddler for Christmas, but I'm still showing it because it's super dainty. And you know, for holidays, we like sparkle, glitter and shine. But I got these off of Amazon by the brand Ethlin. And they're these super cute, gold bracelets for toddlers and they clamp but look at that you guys so beautiful my daughter absolutely loves those i don't let her wear them to school um but she, you know she can wear them outside of school i had to show these because these are super girly and again just glam my sister got these for my daughter there's some michael kors boots um she got them from dillard's super cute and also, I got these. I have not worn them yet, but I think they're super cute. They're from Target by the brand Bobble Bar. They had a gingerbread man and some other different things, but they're like some little, um, you guys, it's leaving my mind. Are they like little frappuccinos or just holiday drinks? But yeah, I got those at Target by Bobble Bar. These little, um, I call them ears, but they're like headbands that are um, glowing here. These came from Dollar Tree. They have a little um, on off button there on the back, um, but these are super cute and they came from Dollar Tree. Also, these reindeer ears came from Dollar Tree. They had them in green and red sequence. And then these reindeer ears came from Walmart for my daughter. She really loves to wear those each year. And also I wanted to go ahead and include this because I think it's absolutely gorgeous it's uh by the brand the perfect purse um and you can find that uh just by googling it or on instagram it's a nice a nice lady um that i know that owns this brand her name's nicole but she has these purses and they are so pretty look at that clasp very spacious on the inside the whole inside does zip down and also um she has where it comes with multiple straps so this strap that she um, adds on she could personalize it so she put my name on it but i also do have two other straps a wide band strap that doesn't have my name and also a skinny strap so i thought that was really cool this here um i'll be wearing for a photo shoot on new year's eve but i still wanted to go ahead and show it because i think this hunter green and the sequence is absolutely gorgeous i hope you guys can see that 
I'm gonna try my best to remember to insert an overlay of what the dress looks like. Um, got this on Shein, so this will also be included on a Shein haul that I'll be filming soon. But I wanted to go ahead and show that because it's still like holiday-ish and I kind of wrap in Christmas and New Year's as one, even though they're two separate holidays. Also glitzy um, gold, um high shine shoes um sandals that i got from um or heels you guys i don't know what these are called i think sandals got these from shein as well so that'll be on my shein haul that i'm gonna wear with this hunter green dress for my sister photo shoot this is from last year got this um off amazon i don't have a brand unfortunately but it's just this cute little holiday drink assortment um, sweat uh, sweatshirt and one of the sleeves is green like on the whole side going down and one is red and black and they're like checkered pattern got this this year from Burlington super cute and makes me think of the holidays it's by the brand oh god I should have looked at this before on on 12th and I got that from Burlington Cup Factory this is left over from last year it's a cute uh, sweater this is by Gap and so I pulled that back out this year. This here, I also got from Burlington um, Coat Factory. It's by the brand Sugar and Rose. And it's this cute gold and black bodysuit. And it's super cute. And I also ordered these pants with these buttons from Shein. And they're like high-waisted pants. So I'm gonna pair that together to make a cute little holiday outfit. And then lastly, from Burlington, I have these silver shimmery pants They're by the brand Copper Flash. And I'm gonna pair them with this sweater that I got from Burlington with these cute little rhinestones on it. This is um, by the brand. Let me see if I can see it, you guys. I may not be able to see it because I don't see a brand up here. But um, look at that super cute sweater with the rhinestones on it. Sorry, you guys. I don't look, think I'm going to be able to find a brand for this. Let's see if it's in here. I don't see a brand yet. Um, but just to go ahead and wrap it up, the other things that are holiday inspired. I also have this uh, sweater that I recently got from Burlington this year. And it has like this netting on the sleeve with rhinestones. And it's by the brand Alice Blue. Again, got that from Burlington Co. Factory. This is a rollover from last year. I got it off of Amazon. It's by the brand Yakun. It is a long black and red checked um, like vest thing. So I'm, I pulled that back out this year to make sure that I wore. Um, got this from Marshalls. Um, it's just a red sweater with this type of detail on the sleeve. It's by the brand Magashani. <laughs> But uh, it's red, and so I can always pair that with something green, you know, to wear it. Have this red blazer by Nine West brand. Um, so I think this is super cute to pair with something, um, like I said, green or white for the holidays. And last but not least, here's what our 2023 family pajamas look like. Um, all of us will have these. My husband, my daughter, and I, we got these from Target. They're by the Wonder Shop brand. But it's just a top and bottom pajama set. Um, in red and white and the sleeves look like this but this will be what we wear for our Christmas holiday um, pajama photos so yeah you guys I hope you all enjoyed all of my holiday inspired things wanted to make sure I come on and share I have to show you all this beautiful like little purse dog is by the brand Poochie and Co we call this particular dog Mariah is the name we gave her but she's like a holiday inspired little dog and she's a like a little purse for the kids but she's a puppy and look at that beautiful red sequence and there's her little tag that says um poochie and co so my daughter does have another one of these dogs that's like a rainbow metallic but when we saw this beauty we had to absolutely get her i got this from the secondhand store kid to kid but i'm sure if you google poochie and co you can find where these are sold but i think this is absolutely adorable and like so like just, it gives the holiday vibes, as I like to say. And I also wanted to share, um, I also wanted to share this little cup. We got it from Dollar Tree and it has a little spiral straw that's in it. My daughter just used it this morning. This one has a snowman and a tree and a little cardinal bird. It's just a cardinal candy cane and has a tree and a gift in the um, like little red wagon with some presents. But I thought this was super cute to be at Dollar Tree um, over by their cups. 
Hubby and I drove around and looked at a few Christmas lights on our date night, so I just thought I would share those here. Um, you know, because looking at Christmas lights, I don't know about you guys, but it just really makes me feel good. But this neighborhood was pretty nice. They had a few winners, like people that really went above and beyond on their Christmas decorations. So I hope you guys enjoy um, looking at these Christmas lights as much as I do, from the plain white to the multicolored or rainbow. I think they're all beautiful and they really help you to feel good and celebrate the holiday season um, for everything, you know, that it truly is. Look at how beautiful. So I've gotten my nails done now to also match my toes. So I wanted to come on and share that. Just have some glittery nails. It will focus here. Oh, yeah. So now I have glittery nails to match my glittery toes for the holidays and the other hand just looks the same of course so here's our contributions to our christmas dinner we just got some kirkland's beef pot roast that we're um bringing that we bought and then we have some little mini but red velvet cakes by the brand von rains red velvet you can find her on instagram but here are the little butt cakes so we got a dozen so here's eight here because it's going to be a small crowd at grandma's and then we have four that are with us that we're taking home so merry christmas it's christmas eve so it's sunday december 24th and this is real life right so what i have remaining are like a lot of gifts for like aunties and some cousins and so usually what i do for those type of gifts is i just like get several many things and i like piece them together to be like you know a little gift bag set so um, this is not a haul of any means but i just have some little bits and bobs that i've collected along the way thinking of individual people and things that they like and so i've kind of put them together and i'm like yeah i'm gonna assemble some bags before i forget I, this was just too cute not to share um this brand pet pet they have some um mommy and me mommy and me or mommy and mini sets on their website um so i went ahead and ordered the barbie two-piece um set for my daughter it's like the sweatshirt and then the little pants and then i just got myself this sweatshirt in a size large and hers is five to six years it's the size i got her but i thought that was super cute i'm not sure if we're wearing that on christmas or if we're wearing it sometime after, but we'll see. And then also I got this from Pat Pat, little LOL surprise long sleeve top. So yeah, and then the rest of the things that I have here, uh oh, child interference, let me lock the door. Um, the rest of the things that I have on my bed, again, are just like little knickknacks and things that I need to put together um, for the bags. But yeah, I just got like an assortment of things that I got from a huge Harry and David basket. So I'm going to, um, you know, disperse these amongst gifts. These are, what are these, chocolate cherries? Yep. And then these are like some little mint chocolates from Harry and David. These are like some little raspberry uh, Gillette cookies. So they're like raspberry and cream. And these are assorted truffles, a bag of Moose Crunch uh, popcorn from Harry and David. And then as you guys can see, these are comfy and cozy socks. This is a fancy pen I got from this uh, store here locally in Atlanta called the Perfect Purse Collection. Check them out on Instagram or Facebook or Google them. Some leftover candy that I had for some other little gifts I put together earlier in December. Um, uh, assorted sweet and savory nuts. And then I have like a bag full of these um, Bath and Body Works Rose Water and Ivy hand sanitizers. I may keep this for myself, this heatless curling set. I mean, I did buy it for me, but I pulled it out in case I decide to gift it. And then these are like little mirrors and little um, travel jewelry boxes. And these are just some assorted wintry socks for my husband. These are like body detox pads and they're made out of ginger you put them in like a foot soaking tub and it turns the water brown but i i promise you when you finish like your feet do feel like so light and airy and clean um the bags that i'm using to gift like the aunties and cousins are these two piece set bags i got from dollar tree like one of them says very merry and the other one says merry christmas so i have a lot of those same bags got some gift tags and then um I kind of ran out of Christmas bags, so I'm going to use a couple of these from um, a purchase earlier in the year. 
And these are just a few last minute gifts that I need to, um, you know, wrap up for my husband and daughter. So we got this for him. I don't want to talk loud. I don't know if you can hear me, but if you need like a flashlight and you need to keep your hands free, this headlamp, you can strap around your head and, you know, work and have light. And then also this was, um, it's going to be on my Shein haul when I upload it, but these are like outdoor LED lights, sensor street lamps that you can mount on the outside of your house. Um, and then this is the last little like item that I need to um, wrap for my daughter. It's like a LOL surprise, uh, OMG doll. She's so pretty. And it comes with some little accessories and everything on the side. So yeah, oh, it's like a little collection of them. So it looks like our girl that we got is, her name is Jams. <laughs> but yeah, you guys. And then these are just some other things that I ordered slash random miscellaneous things that I'm gifting. I have a manager that's coming into town in January. She lives in New York, but I have this like little candy bin. It says Mary and Bright that I'm gonna give her full of assorted name brand chocolates. And then, oops, uh oh, you guys, I ordered this little um, travel jewelry case for me. Again, it'll be on my Shein haul. And um, yeah, some wallpaper. And then just some other little things left over um, from an order I have. I have some Grinch diapers that I'm going to give to my sister for my nephew because he'll hit that size. Um, but my daughter is out of diapers now. But yeah, you guys. And this is just a body shaper um, that I'm going to gift by the brand Sculpt Touch. And these are really good, by the way. So I highly recommend these. But yeah, you guys, that's everything. Just wanted to share. This is real life on Christmas Eve. So I wanted to make sure I share like kind of what um, it's looking like underneath the tree just before we begin to open some of these gifts on Christmas Eve. Because how many of you all do that? Like you kind of slick start opening some gifts on Christmas Eve and then you finish the last few on Christmas Day. But yeah, this is what we're looking like. I got a lot of gifts like hidden behind things. So some little stuff down there. And then I do have some stuff for my daughter's, um, our daughter's birthday um that's over here she has a few things something down there and i got some other stuff that just came in amazon box but yeah you guys down to the wire it's christmas eve and we're just here at the house making the most of it so i'll come on shortly and show you guys a picture of our plate once i finish our little brunch so our christmas eve brunch is done and what we have today are some cinnamon roll waffles, some turkey smoked sausage, hash browns, cheese eggs, and orange juice. But it's about to go down. Here's hubby and I's plate, and um, Zoe has already eaten, so she's not gonna eat. But I'm super excited to try these cinnamon roll waffles. I got the idea off of Winter is Blue. So, num num num. Well, this area old castle looks so pretty. Yeah, and are you playing with your new LOL surprise doll? Yes. What's her name? <laughs> Don't mess up your new box. What does the bottom of your costume look like? It looks like um, Ariel, but I know how we stay. Yeah. The Christmas punch is done. So that's what it looks like. And um, at this point, I'm gonna go ahead and insert, if I haven't already, an overlay to show you guys what the recipe is to make this. Um, I did double the recipe per hubby's request just so it fixes some more. But yeah, it's super simple. You just add in the four ingredients on the screen, the cranberry juice, the orange juice, the ginger ale, and the pineapple juice. Stir it all up. Um, you could add additional sugar if you want. I did not, because I don't want it to be like just, you know, super sweet. But um, yeah, super uh, simple, super easy um, Christmas punch recipe. My mom used to fix it um, when I was coming up some years. And so I just like to try to do different little touches, you know, just to celebrate the holidays and, you know, and make things feel like it's a time of celebration. But I hope you guys try this Christmas punch recipe um, on Christmas Day today or sometime soon. All right, guys. All right, Princess Ariel, you're on video. What would you like to say to your YouTube aunties and uncles and cousins? You just want to sign by the listen tonight. You yeah. don't even have me in the video. Yeah? We filmed the video for night, but I need to put Ariel back. Oh, Lord. What happened to Ariel? It's, it's, can, can you get Ariel from being upside down? Uh-oh. What happened to her? Oh, yeah. You dropped her, boo-boo. Oh, 
need to drop you. Oh, guys, this thing was playing. All right, you're going to say something to your YouTube family? Tell them, say Merry Christmas. I got to say Merry Christmas in a moment. You're going to say Merry Christmas in a moment? Wait a minute, but we got to go. Say Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. You got to look at them and blow them a kiss. Yeah? All done. Yeah? You got makeup, mama? Yes, I What's that? What's that right there? Is that oh makeup, mama? Oh, my goodness. What? And what you got? What's that right there? Mascara or lipstick? Um, That's lipstick? Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Go, big girl. Mm -hmm. Get it, get it. Get it, get it. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Look at this. Yeah, what is that? Um, Daddy, look. Mm-hmm. Girl. Can you open this? See how you make your eyes big? Uh-huh. It's really cute. You make your eyes really long. Yeah. You can do it this way. See? Mommy, look at this. I'm doing my eye thing. That's <laughs> I don't know, boo. You tell me. You don't have any idea what that is? Oh, that's good. Help me. Hold on, boo boo. Are you serious? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> My GoPro. Yes. 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 Oh, man. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I guess you said. I guess you said, let me go on ahead and get this one. I know he really want it. Right. Yay! Oh, man. And I'm not going to record now, it this all. Is, this is the actual, the GoPro's not in here. This is all of the accessories. accessories. Okay, well, keep going then. Oh, but I'm glad you know what it is. Thing in here. It's all kind of Chest stuff. strap, neck, oh head. God. I'm underwater out what this is. I have uh pictures of a lot of the stuff well, it oh it came a, good uh-huh uh -huh. oh man baby now you know you done hooked me up man you know you know you done here this go on that you know you done hooked me up so yeah if the actual camera's not in there keep going because it has some other stuff in some of the other things yay we glad that they like his big gift boo boo yeah and boo boo you this like your makeup like set bro yeah. I'm going to take all this stuff out and put it in here. So I'm and you can use it on the GoPro or for your camera or whatever. Wow! Then this Boo boo, what's this? <gasps> it's a bumper car for indoors and outdoors. And you can go and ride around in it. Isn't that so cool? Oh, man, this thing is kind of Babe, did you, you see her? put this on your phone. Oh, y'all. I forgot I was recording. You do your makeup? Okay, you guys, we've been opening gifts. Boo boo! She'll get excited, y'all, when she figure out what this is. <laughs> Meanwhile, hubby didn't open like three gifts. He's taking his time. Hey, y'all. It's Christmas Eve, and normally I would not film us um, opening some of our gifts, but I wanted to make sure that I shared our excitement and joy with you all. So, yeah, <laughs> my husband's shining one of his gifts <laughs> over here at me. Hey, so you want to show the YouTube family your magnetic dot art set? And my Look, babe. And my oh, wait, we can't show them everything, boo boo. They have to go and watch mommy's What I Got My Tyler for Christmas haul. <laughs> Makeup kit. Let me show you. Oh, wait, they already seen that on an earlier clip. Go show them your magnetic dot art. Bring that over here. But yeah, you guys, a lot of my stuff I already got early. Um, I got a ton of clothes, some the like underwear and bras this. and stuff like that, some boots, some tennis shoes. But my hubby still got me a nice bag of goodies, y'all. I ain't gonna share everything here, but it's like uh $50 gift card and lottery tickets and toiletry things and candy so y'all <laughs> hubby came through so i still have something to open on the day of Mommy. well christmas eve boo boo this you didn't bring your magnetic dot art for the youtube fam to see bring it over here but yeah you guys um i don't know how much more i'll put on this video um because obviously it's christmas eve christmas day i don't know how it's gonna go i know we have family to see and friends to see
but yeah you guys um i hope you all have enjoyed uh, my christmas season um inspiration celebration and um obviously christmas eve spending time with us today and throughout this month of december as we have done our christmas festivities wherever you are you guys take care be blessed make the most of where you are and just remember we love you guys if i haven't already i'm gonna go ahead and insert our 2023 family christmas photo um in here at the end and just put some music to it but again you guys i love you so much thank you guys for rocking with me this year thank you for clicking like thank you for all of my 365 i'm gonna say plus i'm gonna speak that tank thing into existence thank you all for my 365 plus subscribers i continue i will i look forward to continue um sharing life with you all and growing with you all in 2024 um again i love you all take care and be blessed bye I don't a lot for Christmas There is just Oh, you got snacks